Arkham Insider is back, and in the next few episodes, we're going to be taking a look at some of the highlights of the upcoming DLC. Later on, we'll be setting you a score to beat in the theoretically infinite Robin AR challenge. But right now, we're going back to 1989 and hitting the track with the 89 movie pack. It's been a while, but we are back on the couch that must not be named. And I'm joined by Jody and Adam, and we're going to be looking at the upcoming DLC featuring the epic and awesome 89 Batmobile, the Batman skin and the tracks that come with it. Adam, why don't you fire it up and take us on a blasting lap? And Jody, you can talk us through the aesthetic and graphical design because it looks like just all sorts of craziness going on in here. You kind of mashed up the 89 movie with its sequel. What was going on in your brain? It's pretty crazy. So I watched both the films and found a Like just once or like a hundred times? Quite a few times. Okay, it was fine. quite a few times. But I didn't mind, I liked them. So. <laughs> uh, and I found all the best parts that I wanted to put into the tracks. Um, and we've designed the tracks around being a little film set in itself. So oh. we've basically taken all the most iconic, the best bits from all the films and then put them all into this film set so you just get to experience all these locations. So we've just gone track. past the Joker's street parade section. Yeah. There's ducks in there, so there's a suggestion of the penguin action. We've got penguins all over the place. So Serious penguin overload. <laughs> and how did it work for you? Like you're watching the movies and you're sort of thinking, oh that could make interesting gameplay or that yeah, could look well, sweet. What's we, the, we let it what inspire the art for the uh, the tracks but also the design as well. So like for this room for instance it was the penguin lair from the second film. Cool. Um, and there's this giant mural here. And basically I was looking at it in the film thinking, wouldn't it be cool if you just get to drive up it and then it can collapse as you go over it and we added all this amazing VFX and cool penguins everywhere. So yeah, it, it really inspired that and all the way through, I think. Awesome. It looks like a serious challenge as well. Adam, you are sweating while you're driving through this, but nicely handled. You can sort of see the difference between this Batmobile and the Batmobile from the main game as well. Like from a design perspective, how was it creating a track for a different Batmobile than the one that we've been working on for so long? Well, it's longer and um, narrower than our car from the main game, right. so um, we could use that in the tracks. We could have more obstacles that require you to get through smaller gaps. Yeah. And the handling's a bit lighter, so we can have more extreme corners. We had a lot more undulation in this track than we have in the main game. So um, it's just using those elements of the car and feeding them into the track design. What about some hints and tips to get around these tracks? Well, using the boost and the drift again, but also using the side boost, which yeah. is an advanced move where you um, double tap the boost while you're driving in a straight line and awesome. press the direction, it'll move the car in that direction. It'll shift it to the side. Well, looking at the Batmobile and Batman together as a package, as a, as a union, it just looks fantastic. I think the Batmobile looks great. You guys have done, yet again, another awesome job. This DLC coming just around the corner. Jody, Adam, thank you. Joining me on the couch now are two of the best looking guys from Rocksteady Studios, Noel Chamberlain, Harry Finkel, and we have got a showdown for you. Noel is the designer of one of the pieces of upcoming DLC, the Robin AR Challenge, AKA Teen Titan. Harry is renowned in the studio as perhaps the master of this particular map. Harry, kick it off, and I'm gonna to talk to you, Noel, first, about what goes through your brain when you create a challenge not just for Batman, none of the other characters focusing just on Robin. How do you bring all of Robin's strengths in a one man versus a freaking massive thug army like this? So what we wanted to do was just use this challenge to just completely stretch Robin just to his limit. So yeah. we wanted to just throw everything at him. Because he's a brute, isn't he? He's a much more kind of physical character than Batman. That's it, is. yeah. He doesn't have as many gadgets as Batman. He likes to get up close and personal with his staff, with yeah. his bullet shield, with his zip kick. Nice. Just get right involved and just... So you're havoc. throwing in some seriously big characters here already. That's it, we've got everyone that Batman's been facing. So we've right. got the brutes, we've got the combat experts, the medics, and then we also throw in weapons in there. We've got rifles, uh, riot shields, baseball bats, just everything. Harry's racked up one star already. Let's set him some challenges. So what can he possibly do? He can do all of Robin's moves. Uh, there's three stars to get. And let's set him a combo chain of 150. He's already up to 71. That should, no, let's, let's make it 200. 200 unbeaten. There's second star already. He is ripping through this. How are you feeling, Noel? Seeing someone like Harry just tearing oh. up your concept, tearing up the, 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 the child, the brain child that you've been working on for so long. I'm just going to wait and watch. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, what sort of moves can he pull off? We know Robin's got some righteous moves. What are we expecting to see? So we can do things like the staff sweep just to clear space for Robin. Boom, there it is, on target, right on time. It's as if Harry was thinking, I'm gonna stuff this right in Noel's face. I'm gonna rip open this staff sweep just to show him that I can pull it off anytime I want, anywhere I want. Oh, that was another hot move. Dude, this is intense. There are so many guys. Three stars, star. three star Harry, they call him. Oh, dropped at 16. How you feeling, Harry? But all the pressure's getting cranked up. Yeah. yeah Do you want me to stop talking to you? Do you no, need to I enjoy the talking. Yeah. It distracts me from right. my inevitable doom. <laughs> oh, another big move. The Robin throw. 200 seems a long way off. He bagged those three stars like it was nothing. That's because it was early days and that was before it started getting uh -huh. really intense. All right, what else is there? Bullet shield? Yeah, you can do the bullet shield. It's the same as Batman's quick wreck. Okay. Harry. Bam! That was nice! All right, Harry, whatever score you set at the end of this, we are going to stick that up online and challenge gamers out there to try and beat Harry. Hashtag beat Harry. <laughs> If you can, while you're focusing your brainium on not being slaughtered, talk us through the strategic decisions you're making. Um, well, a lot of it's micromanagement. I mean, there's a few kind of prime threats that come in that you've got to try and, well, personally, I try to deal with uh -huh. as soon as humanly possible. I mean, stuff like brutes, those guys are real quick. I mean, similar with combat experts. Ow. They can cover distance, speed, and. That is something you don't want to be doing on the map when you've got other things around, you know. When the guns come up, right. you've got to get those Tons quick fire gadgets. Deal with them fast. Absolutely, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, one of the main keys is just concentration. I'm up to combo you know. here, bro. Did you talk about, you are saying concentrating. One of the main keys, concentrating? It is concentrating. 99, 101! Oh, 103! Halfway there. So, people talking at you and kind of yelling near you, does that help your concentration? Or yeah, is really, that I mean, I, I, in? actually, to be honest, I can't do it without it. Right. <laughs> Harry! Be the boy wonder, Harry. Be the Robin. Actually, on second calls, that doesn't really help at all. <laughs> one, four, three, one, four, six. What do you think? Are you sweating, Noel? Are you feeling this? He's 50's a long way with Ryan Force and stun sticks. Ooh! <laughs> oh. Bro! Drops it at 155. And Harry's racked up 20 rival points there. Noel, talk us through the rival point system. So what we do is you get the three stars yep. and they count to three points on the Gotham's greatest. Mm -hmm. And then what we wanted to do is because we know our player base is really dedicated, they love our combat system, we wanted to push it further. So we have a total of up to 20 rival points for every challenge as well. Okay. So once you get the three stars, if you get another 10,000, you'll get another two rival points. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a prestige for each player and kind of it makes so you can beat your friends by a thousand points. All right, nice. So it's not just about stars anymore. Like the stars are still important, but they're a, a foundation that then rival yeah. points can go beyond that. Oh, sweet breakout holds the combo. Uh -huh. One for one. One for four. This is where he, about where he dropped it last time at 155. That helps. We're at 153. <laughs> oh! 165. All right, this is the best that we've seen. Noel, how are you feeling? Talk us through it. Show us your emotions. I'm just waiting for Harry to drop it. I'm waiting for a rifle guard. Ah, Harry is. 15 to go! Ah! No way! No way! Oh, you've got so little health left, Harry. It's in the bag. It's all good. Yeah. You talk a good game. You've got to have that superhero arrogance, it's the only way of doing it. You just. Oh! 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 Dead big triple takedown! Oh! Four, nine, seven, five, sixty. Four, nine, nine, five hundred, one forty. Finkel, you have done yourself proud. Oh, nice. Nicely done. It's a rifle. You've got like one hit left in you. goes down, a knife to the back, what a way to go.
That was some seriously sinister design work from No Mercy Noel. An incredible effort from half a mil, Harry. If you guys can even come close to that and even go beyond and crack that half a million, let us know you've done it at hashtag beatharry. That's it for Arkham Insider. We'll see you next time.